Hi, this is Joan Pratt with Remax Professionals. Thank you for watching my video blog. Today we're going to be talking about the top five questions I get from sellers in today's hot market. Before we get on to our topic, please take a look at the two little links below this. The first one is Instant Home Value, and this will give you instant access to the current value of your home. The second link is Search All Available Properties. Now let's get back to our topic. In this hot market, the most frequently asked question I get from sellers is definitely where will I go if my house sells in a day or two or two hours for that matter. And I always advise my clients that the most important thing to know is as a seller in this market, you have the control. So you have flexibility to rent back with the post-closing occupancy agreement. You'll have flexibility to extend the closing. Um, and with buyers competing for your home, you have a lot more control over the situation. And if you have a really great realtor on your side, we can really make the terms very favorable to you. So I would never tell anyone to wait to put their house on the market until they find the perfect home, because when you go to buy that perfect home, they're going to want your house to already have been sold so that you can be the strongest buyer possible. The number two question I receive from sellers is how soon will I have to be out? We address this a little bit in question one, but the typical contract these days takes about 35 days. There are certainly investors out there that are cash and have no contingencies and could close sooner, but the shortest amount of time you could expect to be um, from contract to closing would be 35 days. And then of course we have the options of extending for, for um, post-closing occupancy and things like that. The number three most asked question is what do I have to do and who's going to get this work done? So the short answer is you're probably way more critical of your house than I would be. And I can come in and help you prioritize the things that need to get done to put it on the market. I also will bring in a professional stager and handyman to get some of that work off your plate and to really make your house shine. The number four question that we have often is how do we deal with showings? And at Remax Professionals and the J. Pratt Group, we um, pay for a showing service. The showing service is a phone number that you can program into your phone. Um, they will send you a text, an email, or a phone call, to, or all three, depending on your request, um, to set up a showing. Oftentimes, a showing will look like this. The showing service will receive a call at 9 o'clock in the morning that someone would like to show your house between 10 a.m. and 12 p.m. That's a one-hour notice and what's called a two-hour window. Now, I have plenty of people that are really meticulous that would like to know the previous day, so they could call on a Tuesday for a showing on Wednesday. Now, in the cases where there are multiple showings in a day, we will often put a limit on how many people can be through at one period of time, or if you choose just to let everyone through at once, we can do that as well. So there's lots of different options that we can do. It's very flexible and it's very customized to whatever you need. This one is everyone's favorite topic and also one of the most difficult parts. Number five is how do we deal with multiple offers? If we receive multiple offers, the purchase contract is complex enough, let alone having five or 10 or 15 or some we've written on, there have been 20 different offers on. Here at the J. Pratt Group, we actually have a spreadsheet that compares up to 10 offers side by side and it will help you determine what your net is on each one of those offers. And sometimes there's just intangibles as well, as like if you wanted to rent it back and one of the offers allows you to rent it back. There's a great value in there. I hope this information on the top five questions I received from sellers was helpful to you. If you have any questions or comments or ideas for future topics, please give us a call, shoot us a text or an email. Thank you.